Hello guys, welcome, so good to have you back. Today I'm going to read a little section, a chapter from St. Augustine Confessions. I'm going to do this from time to time, just uh, read a chapter or so from some of the books that I'm reading. After all, these authors are incredibly inspirational and um, they've also had their part to play in writing, I guess, our present into the history books, if you want to think of it like that way. Um, so yeah, I'm going to read St. Augustine, Confessions, and it's Book 1, Chapter 20. And yet, and yet, Lord, even if you had willed that I should not survive my childhood, I should have owed you gratitude, because you are our God, the supreme good, the creator and ruler of the universe. For even as a child I existed, I was alive. I had the power of feeling. I had an instinct to keep myself safe and sound, to preserve my own being, which was a trace of the single unseen being from whom it was derived. I had an inner sense which watched over my bodily senses and kept them in full vigor. And even in the small things which occupied my thoughts, I found pleasure in the truth I disliked finding myself in the wrong. My memory was good. I was acquiring the command of words. I enjoyed the company of friends and I shrank from pain, ignorance and sorrow. Should I not be grateful that so small a creature possessed such wonderful qualities? But they were all gifts from God, for I did not give them to myself. His gifts are good, and the sum of them all is my own self. Therefore, the God who made me must be good, and all the good in me is his. I thank him and praise him for all the good in my life, even my life as a boy. But my sin was this, that I looked for pleasure, beauty, and truth, not in him, but in myself and his other creatures. And the search led me instead to pain, confusion and error. My God, in whom is my delight, my glory and my trust, I thank you for your gifts and beg you to preserve and keep them for me. Keep me too. And so your gifts will grow and reach perfection and I shall be with you myself, for I should not even exist if it were not by your gift. So there we go, St. Augustine's Confessions. That's actually in book one, chapter 20. I uh, really enjoyed reading this book. Just wanted to share a little bit with you and uh, yeah, I really resonate with that and just, yeah, enjoying reading it. I hope you're also encouraged by that. Be blessed, enjoy the rest of your weekend, take care and thank you so much for listening.